Hey guys, in this video, I am giving you a demo about the Google My Business flow in UChat. So in your flow, click it, open it, edit flow. So from the start point, let's firstly create a same message step for the greeting. Like, like hello, welcome, and then give a card. So the titles make it okay. So I'm showing you four function. The first one is send message, a send image. We will use a send message step to send the image. Okay, so in rich media, go image, you can choose also audio, video, file, and location. So for image, click it. Okay, paste the address and then save. Okay, this is, this is how you send a uh, media file and then let's send a location. So we are also using a send message step to send a location. So in ch choose media, reach media again and then location. So here is where you put the address name. Okay, so how you, how you get the latitude and the longitude for your address, you can just simply go uh, Google map and search your address and then right click it. So click this string of number, then you copy the latitude and longitude, paste it. Move the latitude down and then remove the comma. Okay, so label is for you to giving some more detail like uh, I'm at the level two. Level two room one, two, three. Okay, so this is how you send a location. And then let's try ask a question like Ask for some user information. This time we are using a question step to do so. Okay, so save it in the question step. So you can choose what kind of answer, what type of answer you are expecting. So now we are asking for an email. So click email and then give the prompt. Okay, so please leave your email address and then we're going to save the response in email variable. You can give quick answer, skip button and no match. So when users are not giving a correct format email address, then this retry message will show. Okay, so the email address is incorrect, please retry. And then you can also choose if not matching uh, third time, fourth time, fifth time, and you can go to another step to deal with this situation. And also no input. If defaultly, if user doesn't input in an hour, um, you chat will continue to the next step that you link to this question step. And you can also adjust it like to five minutes and then go to another step. Yeah, it's up to you, okay? So this is how you send, uh, how you ask a question. And then let's try talk to agent. Okay, now we are linking this talk to agent button with the action step. And when user click the, uh, talk to agent, then you can change the persona. So in advanced section, go set persona and then you can change the persona from default to, for example, Peter. So on the user side, they are uh, not talking with a bot anymore. They are talking to someone called Peter and with this profile photo. Okay. Or you can choose to send a notification like email notification, Slack, SMS, or make a phone call to your staff. And then they can go back to UChat and go to the live chat here to talk to the client support them okay so uh, let's send a message like ok 
Okay, how may I help you? Alright, so this, let's test it. Now by copying and pasting the test URL, let's launch the conversation. You chat for agent. Okay, now the bot said thanks for contacting you chat. What can I help you with today? So let me try. Hi, hello, welcome. And then the card. Okay, so this card. Let's try some diff uh, features. Press the button below. Let's try send image. Okay, we receive the image and then send location. Melbourne Central Station level 2 R123. Okay, click open in Google. Okay, now I get the location and I can navigate to it. Okay, right. Then ask for email. Let me try input something that is not a email format. Okay, so the retry message now show. The email is incorrect, please retry. Okay, I'm trying one, two, three, at gmail.com. Maybe I can add one more send message step. Okay, let me add a send message step to show the email address here that we get from the user. Okay, so publish and let's try again. So again, I send hi, ask for email. So when I check one, two, three, at gmail.com, send. Good, your email is one, two, three, at gmail.com. Then let's try talk to agent. Here you see. Here you can see the profile photo is changed from YouChat to uh, Peter's profile photo. And the name here is not YouChat or Agent anymore. It becomes Peter. And Okay, so from now on, you are talking to Peter. And okay, so let's back into YouChat in live chat. Here is where you can talk to the client. So now Peter is saying, so I can change my uh, persona to be Peter. Then I'm replying as the person Peter. Okay, so hey Joyce, and you can see in the phone, Peter said hey Joyce. All right, that's the basic introduction about Google My Business Flow. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please comment below. See you next time.